This lecture is about assignment operators. This is the Python command and this is the assignment operator that is used in Python and it assigns the value of right side of expression to the left side operand. So we will see x is equal to 5 and we will print the value of x here this is 5 and next one is number 2 is add and assign your symbol is this this will add right side operand with left side operand and then assign to the left operand x is equal to 10 x plus is equal to 20 and next we are going to print x that is equal to 30 output and next one number third is subtract and so this is the symbol it will subtract right operand from left operand and then assign to left operand and let's suppose we are going to write x is equal to 500 x x minus equal sign and let's suppose I am going to write 300 say print x so the answer is 200 it will return true if both the operands are equal uh, we have done this 300 minus 300 is equal to 0 and next one is the fourth one is equal to multiply and and this the symbol is asterisk followed by assignment operator this will multiply right operand with the left one x is equal to let's suppose i'm going to write 50 and next x is equal to oh, let's suppose 30 and we will print x you can see that the value is 1500 so this multiply and will multiply right operand with the left operand and then assign to the left operand so next one is divide and divide and so this is the symbol it will divide left operand with right operand and then assign to left operand so x is equal to let's suppose i'm going to write 450 and next uh, uh, let's suppose 150 and in the end i'm going to print the x here so 3.0 the floating floating point is answer and the sixth one this one was our four fifth example and fourth example and here i'm going to show you sixth example of this lecture that is modulus that is modulus and followed by this assignment it takes modulus using left and right operands and assigns results to left operand so we are going to write the let's suppose 10 and next modulus equal sign and 3 next we are going to print the 
output that is equal to 1 as we have divided 10 by 3 and we can see that the modulus is 1. So in the next lecture we will continue this 